What is up guys, TV Fish 15 back here again. I just dropped a bunch of shit. I, I just dropped some shit! What is up everyone, TV Fish 15 back here again to show you my Slipknot mask collection. Uh, there's a lot of popularity going around on my unboxing, my uh, Chris and my Craig one, so I might as well share the whole collection. Um, this is my Joey All Hope is Gone mask. This one was made like pretty much straight out of a blank kabuki mask by my brother Vile Self, so go check him out, he's pretty awesome. Um, you can see the video about this mask right there, and it's uh, really cool, a lot of detail. I modified it a little bit just for accuracy's sake, but it looks really cool. I was actually Joey for um, Halloween this past year. This is my Chris mask um, video right here, if you haven't seen it. For the unboxing, this mask is amazing. <laughs> like, this is probably the most well-made mask out of my whole collection. Like, the straps are... Like, this is like some real leather. Like, leather leather. Really good. I got this um, from a guy called Sculpt Mold Cast Repeat on Facebook. Makes amazing Chris masks. Makes amazing zipper works. Sorry, one hand, it's hard. And uh, the nose is also good. So there's my Craig mask video here. If you haven't seen the unboxing of that one. I changed this one quite a bit from when I originally got it. Um, in the original video, the nails were, uh, well, there goes my clown, were uh, much shorter. And uh, there were no eyelets in the nose. But since then, we've got uh, these uh, seven inch um, gutter spikes from Lowe's, and they came in like packs of ten, so I had to get like three or four of them. And then recently we got um, this from Michaels, eyelets with setter kit, and I put some eyelets in the nose. So this mask looks much better than when I first got it. It's much lighter. much lighter than um, before because the nails are aluminum so they're just really really light so next my clown this is my all hope is gone clown oh I got that mask from a guy named maggot Matt on eBay I don't think he has anything listed anymore but he did and I had to jump at the chance for this mask it's a really good mask so this clown I got from hammerheart 44 on eBay still selling these masks like this exact one. Um, this isn't like, I got this for like 50 bucks. It's pretty good for your money, I guess. You know, it's got a working zipper, all the rivets. It didn't come, like it was completely black and I had Vile Self paint the red and the white in the nose. So it looks accurate to the real thing. It doesn't have any lenses in the eyes. I don't know if I'm going to put anything there. I have no idea, but um, yeah, this is a pretty good mask. It's good for... You know, if you're low, if you're like cut for money, if you don't want to pay too much, and this is like 50 bucks, it's really good alternative. Um, this Cory mask was just like a leftover sculpt that Vile Self made because he made a Volume Three Cory, and it looks really cool. But um, I remember I was at his house and like we were looking at his mask, and he's like, "You want it?" And I'm like, "Sure." So um, I might get him to repaint it, and then I'll strap it. It was funny about this one because like my head's bigger than his. So when I put it on my, like, when I, when I put his, like, volume 3 on my face, um, the jaw wouldn't move when I, when I opened my mouth. It would look stupid. And this is my All Hope is Gone, Corey. I got this from Triple Seven. Triple Seven, Seven, Seven. Um, he has his mask everywhere. It's on eBay. It's on iOffer. It's on Etsy. It's on pretty much everything. And I'd say it's pretty damn good. Um, the only flaws is that the ear hole is misplaced. My ear... When I wear it, it's like right there, and that's the hole, so I, don't I have no idea what kind of armature he used. Um, the eye mesh is pretty good. It's not like exact mesh mesh, but you can barely see shit when you, <laughs> when you put it on, so I guess that's pretty accurate. The inside is like burlap, so that when you undo the buckles, it sort of keeps the shape. And the interesting that there's two, there's actually a, a Slipknot show that I like watched on YouTube where he does have an all of his gone mask that only has two so I guess that's 
pretty accurate when you take into account that one, but he used acrylic paint. Which is like, no, because it's all crackly. But, I mean, if you don't really get up close with it, the mask looks really good. So that's my Slipknot mask collection, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed it. I will be getting more Slipknot masks whenever I can. I mean, the collection's not done. We need to have all nine. So I'm T. Fisher Teen, and I'll see you guys later.